Hey, hello everybody, this is Spider-Man117 here back with another review for Die Hard with a Vengeance. So, anyways, this film was directed by John McTiernan, stars Bruce Willis as John McClane and Samuel L. Jackson uh, as Zeus. And then it stars Jeremy Irons as Simon Peter Craig Gruber, he's Hans Gruber's brother. And anyways, basically, he's playing this, like, cat and mouse game, the whole fucking movie, running around fucking town, doing some fucking crazy-ass Simon Says shit, and then fucking all of a sudden, Simon Peter Craig Gruber's going in there to steal some fucking gold, though, like, a hundred billion dollars worth of gold, and uh, die hard with a vengeance. Uh, anyways, this movie's really action-packed, it's fun, it's exciting, and I'm not saying it's better than the first Die Hard, but, man... This movie still holds up uh, for how old it is. I mean, it's not too bad, but anyways, they're just uh, driving around town, and Bruce Willis, like, gets called upon, and he has to, like, do Simon Says, and basically the movie starts out. He goes in Harlem and has something on the sign that I'm not really going to say because I don't want to get demonetized by YouTube, but... Anyways, then he finds Samuel Jackson's character, and they got to do this, like, cat and mouse game all around town, driving through town, and then there's a, a bomb on, on the subway, and, like, Bruce Willis is on the subway, like, he's in there, and he's finding the bomb, but then Samuel Jackson has to go to the phone and, like, talk to Simon Peter Craig Gruber, but... Anyways, he talks to him, and McLean's not there, and then the bomb was going to go off anyways, but Bruce Willis chucked the bomb out the back and then blew the whole fucking subway up, and the subway uh, car just sat there and hit hit some poles and, like, screwed the underground up and blew it up, and then he's still alive after all that, and then they get up, and they're just going through town in a taxi, <laughs> trying, trying to cut some time down, um... And then they got to find a bomb in a school. I mean, you, you think that bomb was big? <laughs> Damn, it, get, it gets bigger. And then they're, like, they, they're playing, like, some elephant or what has four legs. And this fucking, like, elephant statue has the bomb. And my thing is, is like, if he wouldn't open the bomb, the bomb would have never activated. But he opens the bomb, and they got to pour... They get four gallons of water, but they only have a three-gallon container and a five-gallon container, so somehow they got to get four gallons in the five-gallon thing, in the container, anyways. And then they do that, they survive, and then, like, they get on bikes. Uh, Samuel Jackson's character, Zeus, does with John McClane, and damn near gets hit by a fucking, like, semi-truck, <laughs> or a dump truck anyways and they're following them and basically then they have to uh, like get on a they're in a truck and they hijack it and then he's like oh man why, why is this guy got like 10 quarters though and, and he does so he can get across the bridge but then they say fuck it and they throw down a cable and go on the boat and they do that and this guy gets fucking cut in half by a fucking wire the side like that fucking big just knocks him right in fucking half and he's fucking dead and the guy is fucking KO'd and anyways they're down there and then they try to call the coast guard so they know what boat it is but then uh Gruber <laughs> is there and he stops him and then both Samuel Jackson and Bruce Willis's character are like back to back with handcuffs though and all day he's like, I've had a real bad fucking headache. And uh, Simon Peter Craig Gruber gives uh, John McClane his uh, fucking, <laughs> not Advil, but fucking headache medicine. And then basically, like, they get a wire and they sit there and they, uh, Zeus, like, gets John McClane out of the handcuffs and he gets out and then he drops the fucking pin and then they say, fuck it. And he sits there and he, has a chemical reaction, fucking gets Samuel Jackson's character out of the fucking handcuffs, though. And then they jump off the boat, it fucking blows up. And then he call, uh, John McClane calls his wife and, like, <laughs> ends up seeing on the back of the headache medicine where 
uh, Simon Peter Craig Gruber is, and he sees him, and or know, knows where he is, and then anyways, they follow him on the helicopters, and like police cars, and they stop the truckers from getting away with over a hundred billion dollars worth of gold, and they stop him anyways, and then, uh, Simon Peter Craig Gruber has a M60 because he was Hans Gruber's brother and he wants to shoot John McClane and he tries to shoot him and he's like say hello to your brother for me and he shoots the fucking power line and it hits the helicopter and blows up <laughs> and he's like yippee ki motherfucker and, and Sam, Samuel L. Jack well anyways uh, Bruce Willis tells Samuel Jackson's like should we call a fire Fire department, and he's like, no, fuck them, let them burn. <laughs> and I, I think it's not as good as the original Die Hard, but it is really funny, and I've always enjoyed the movie, and I'd probably give it like an 8.5 out of 10. So that's my opinion, but hey, let me know in the comment section how everybody else feels. Have a good night.